What's up? Just kidding. Good morning to the best family on YouTube. I am currently in New York. So I decided to start the vlog here and didn't even vlog anything from LA since my flight was so early in the morning. Currently at Dunkin' Donuts, which is a big thing on the East Coast, which we don't have on the West Coast. About to get something. I flew business class. They flew us business class and there was free food free drinks for everything and I fell asleep the whole way through because they had bed so I was like flat so I didn't even get to eat anything so I'm about to eat right now waiting for Roman then gonna head to the hotel so not only did I just find out that we are not staying at the same hotel but we are also at different sections of the airport right now but it's okay because I had hash browns and an egg and cheese bagel yo so that taxi behind me has an Aladdin thing on the top of it. If Aladdin is on Broadway right now, I definitely have to go to that. So that's a top priority. Since I did miss the Lion King in Broadway, which is unacceptable, unacceptable. That's unacceptable. So I just got to my hotel. And first things first, this is burning. So I have to see how to turn this off. And guys, we have to talk. So if you guys know, why I left Turkey, it's because I didn't have my medicine, right? So I didn't have my medicine in Turkey and I had to come home. Well, I don't have my medicine right now and um, it's been two days without medication. So tomorrow will be the third and that's when everything starts and that's when my mind starts having brain zaps and that's when it gets difficult for me. So I'm really hoping that Simi is able to get my medicine and ship it to me in time or else this is gonna be a disaster for me because four days, five days without my medicine is really, 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 really bad. And uh, to be honest with you guys, I'm super anxious right now because I don't wanna be alone in New York. New York already scares me and just feel like, I'm just feeling anxious right now because I'm so far from home. I don't have a dollar, I don't have muffin. And you guys know I spent all my time by myself in my apartment in LA, but that's like my comfort place. So now that I'm outside of my comfort zone and I'm alone, I don't want to be alone and I'm not feeling too good right now. And I'm actually feeling scared and anxious and it's not a good feeling. So yeah, uh, hopefully this trip shapes up and this is just the first day and I'll wake up tomorrow and I'll have my medicine and I shave and I feel good and I'm back to normal and I get to reunite, you know, with my homies and stuff. I'm actually about to go meet up with Roman right now just because I'm not feeling good. So I'm so glad I have you guys with me to talk to during times like these because it's, 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 it's scary, it's scary. I just opened my suitcase and didn't even remember that I packed all these wristbands right here. These are the ones with black writing though, so I'll be giving them out to Brub as I see them in New York. I brought these shoes just like this. I hate traveling with shoes because they get messed up. See how they like, they get deformed when you carry them in a bag like that? But yeah, I'm about to put something comfy on because I've been uncomfortable in what I was wearing all day. And you know when you're uncomfortable in what you're wearing, you just don't feel like yourself and it just makes you feel weird? Well, that's how I felt all day. Okay guys, so I'm roaming the streets of New York right now, trying to find some friends. I'm gonna go up to random people and just say hi. Hey, I'll be your friend. Oh! Well, oh, my girl, bro. Yeah. Hey, it's the Brubra Nation! Right, we're, we're not the nation. The world. We're, just, we're, just, we're just the Brubras. There's so much to do in New York, man. Is there? Do you want a bike? Let's have a bike. Let's, let's take a bike. a bike. So guys, I finally found my friends. Charles is up there too, doing his thing. So I'm feeling a little better now. I was telling them how I was anxious and scared when I was by myself. Wow. I told Roman, I was like, I can't even believe Fusi's coming because he doesn't have anyone with him. Exactly. I, 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 almost had, I was scared in my hotel room. I was like, this doesn't feel right. Really? That's why I tweeted you guys and I was like, y'all got an extra bed? I was, <laughs> I was like, I want to come. You were kidding. No, I was we dead totally serious. We have room in our bed. I was, <laughs> <laughs> I was scared, but now it's better, guys. And we're walking to Shake Shack to get a Shake bite Shack. to eat. There he is. What's up, Charles? I feel yo, like yo. he's definitely. I don't think you've ever said hi to my vlog. Oh, sorry, sir. Hi, guys. <laughs> There's so many vlogs everywhere. I love it. <laughs> so, we'll let you guys know how the food goes. All right, so we just we got to Shake Shack, but look how long the line is right now. It is out the door going that way. You're that hungry, right? <laughs> oh, I'm going to kill each other. 
Yeah. I'm gonna kill you, Charles Trippie. This is New York though, in case you guys haven't seen New York. I'm so tired of this turtleneck though. Brittany, how bad is this turtleneck? It's not bad, it looks fine. Hey, can I have a selfie? Hi! He's got it going. There we go. Thank you. So yeah, guys. We're about to wait in line for Shake Shack. Alright, so we finally got a table. We did it. Look, 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 look where Brittany's sitting right now. It's a Z. You did it. To make room for me, and we made friends right here. Hello. Jessica and Rachel. Oh, you know their names already. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Rachel. That's not your name, is it? That's not your name? What's your name? Catalina. Hi, Catalina. Joseph. No, what? That's not even my name. John. There it is. get the I just know I never All right, I'm going to stop this. I'm sorry. Leave it in. Wider. I'm getting a new vlog. <laughs> Dang. Dang. No, that's sweet. Dude. I'm looking at Charles' vlog camera and it actually shows more of my face. No, you look amazing. I look better? <laughs> you really look amazing. Oh, yeah, it's uh, for depth. It is a little bit bare. It's way wider. I'm telling you, they got a new one. This isn't the one that I had. That is awesome. All right, I'm not too proud of this, but a double with cheese fries and a shake. You gotta be proud of that. You gotta be proud of it? Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm They're not proud of it though. Okay guys, check this out. I hated this sweater so much. And this is the one I just bought when I went with Simi. Uh, I smelled like it smelled like Shake Shack. But it's one of those Kanye type sweaters, turtleneck. I hate it so much that I'm done with it. The first bra to come up to me tomorrow, I'm gonna give it to. I'll be holding it randomly in my hand. But not just the first bra like if a bra comes up to me and goes, hey, are you that guy from YouTube? No, I tweeted about that today and people got upset. I was like, no, I'm not the guy from YouTube. No, I'm not the foosy guy. And no, you don't remember me from somewhere. What I meant by that was, you guys would be surprised how many times people come up to you and they just go, you're that. You're that, you're that, you're that guy, that guy from YouTube, and then they're like, can you get a picture? And I'm like, you know, my bruh-bruhs wouldn't ever, you know, do that. But anyways, that's aside the point. The first person who comes up to me and goes, bruh, do you have the sweater? I'm gonna give this to tomorrow in New York, because I don't want it anymore. And yeah, I just got back to my hotel room. The Shake Shack's in my stomach, so actually, I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. Ooh, look at this. New York fashion, check this out. I'm gonna have to get into this in a second, actually. All right, bro, bros. <laughs> I think I'm gonna end the vlog right here. Why is the lighting so weird in this hotel room? Um, I thank you guys for being with me on this trip. I really do appreciate it. Um, please extra, extra pray for me or, or wishful thinking for me that I'm able to get my medication because if not, tomorrow's gonna be a really bad day and after tomorrow is gonna be even worse. So please uh, uh, pray for that. And yeah, I just thank you guys for being in my life and coming with me to these trips, man. I'm just trying to figure my life out at the moment, trying to figure myself out and you know, you guys are with me along on the road, you know, the people who choose to come back every day. It sucks because doing vlogs, like, I can read the comments, I can see the likes, I can do all that stuff, but it, it, it still leaves a sense of emptiness because there's such a different feeling when I actually get to meet you guys and get to put it into perspective. So when there goes days where I don't get to meet like true bruh bruhs or I don't get to see you guys, it's just I feel empty because I don't get to feel the actual thing that what we have because it's hard, you know, to feel it through vlogs and comments and, you know, Twitter and stuff when I actually just want to feel it in real life. So. I do appreciate you guys coming back though every day just to let me know that you guys are there and that I have somebody supporting me every day because I appreciate that so much. And I thank you guys so much and I'll see you tomorrow on another edition of Dose of Fusi where Mondays and Tuesdays usually the grind doesn't stop. Um, the tea which hasn't been drunk in a long time is usually green and uh, lions uh, when they do make a sound kind of sounds like rah. <laughs>